This is not what I was hoping for when it said urban environment. This is the gas station. I did not want gas station. But here we are. We're in gas station land. This this would have been fine for snipers. I would I was thinking like TV store, laundromat, but uh video store sort of thing. This is not that. This is not that at all. And we start not in a corner, which is also pretty bad. Uh let's let's throw one of these over here. See if there's anyone Yeah, there are. Look at those sectoids. Ugh, I was hoping to make for that building and hide. Well, um... Let's move the saw up, and we'll see how bad this goes. <laughs> this could go bad. Yeah, especially if they all run away. I can't really reach them. Right? Uh, not really, no. I can definitely get some great angles. You're just gonna move up to here and probably take a sh You can't take a shot from here. Fine, you can you can run and gun. And maybe... I don't know if you'll be able to see any sectoids from here. Will you see that one? No. You can suppress, though. So we can suppress both of these sectoids. Never mind, you also cannot see them. So you're going to have to run a gun as well. To right here. Okay, we do have sight on that one from here. In which case, we probably want to run a gun someone up to maybe here. And then they could take care of that sectoid. But I will get flanked very easily. That is the issue. No one else can uh, really do too much. All so far back. I think we're gonna have to use almost all of our running guns. Already just there. running up and overwatching. Because we are not in a good area right now. Come on, 70%. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. In which case, we can start taking the front of this car and this, like this side now. I don't want to move up too far, there could be another pod there. You right here. Where do we want you to go? I mean, we we go like, you run like right here, get a really close range shot at him. I don't know if we want to risk that though. Shotgun guy could probably move here. He won't be able to use flashbang. We can't use any flashbangs, more or less. Oh, we can get roof. We could get the roof. Shotgun guy is not going to go to the roof. That is just not his forte. Double time. But we can have uh, SMG guys around the roof. The height advantage may be what we need. That's actually 70% chance from right here. That's a great chance. Well, it was through a brick wall. All right. You actually can't reach there, so you're probably going to be here. And we're going to hope for a close range bonus. Or an Overwatch. These two are going to be suppressing. Making sure that nothing terrible happens. 35 and a 32. And those are some pretty bad numbers. Can't even kill if you hit, so you might as well Overwatch. You are probably going to suppress, but we're going to hold off. We are going to move one or two guys up to the roof to see if that height advantage helps. So let's move you here. I really wish you'd take the other direction, like, go through here. We should test that when we have the chance. Is it worth risking that? I don't, I don't think it's worth risking that. Let, let's move you to here. Like, would it be shift? It, it's definitely not shift. So it'd be like control click. Yeah, see that definitely just censor this. We can't path anyone. Unfortunate, but you will now go up this. Alright, yeah, you'll you'll run right through there. See how blue moves and yellow move. Alright, sectoids. Lots of shot here. Forty-seven percent. No chance of kill. 
Uh, we may just want to do a lot of overwatches here. Um, we're not even going to run and gun you just in case. We are actually just going to dash you up to here. And you're just going to stay in there. We want to save a couple of these running guns. And that guy over there, that's right, he used his uh, motion scanner. Okay, so you are going to suppress that guy. You're going to use most of your ammo. And then you are going to suppress that guy. Copy that. And hopefully that keeps them from pulling anything too deadly. Okay, that's a 1%. Gonna run? No, he's gonna fire a 1% again. 98 more of those shots and we will die. Okay, so now that we have successfully done that... We just run up and easily tack them out. Goodbye, Sector. Shotgun guy. Oh, shotgun guy. Right on in. Take him right on out. Yeah, that's right. You shoot the corner and it works. Okay, you have a motion tracker. Let's turn that on. There are more baddies on the other side of this wall. In which case, um, let's yeah, let's yeah, have yeah. you move up. Three more baddies on the other side of that wall. We're gonna have to move in to uh, flank them. We don't. They're gonna see us through that window, so we want to make sure everyone sprints up to the garage. You are really far back, so uh, you're not gonna be in this fight at all, <laughs> unfortunately. Affirmative. Moving out. I am a little afraid that you'll trigger, just a little bit. I don't think you will. Because you're going to run this way, hopefully. Yeah, there we go. Um, You can move. Let's move you here. Smoking my bacon. Apparently that's smoking her bacon. There we go. Now, what kind of enemy could it be, though? See, do we, we do have a nice window from up here. So you can actually move up here. And see who it is. It's bloaters. It's hard to differentiate where the organic material ends. Thankfully, they're the stupid. Begins. I got no criticals on floaters, which is not great. Sure. All right. Um, you can move here, and you'll have. Okay, thought the game crashed. <laughs> really thought the game crashed. There's four of them. In that case, what we need to do is move you up we need to weaken them we need to soften these bad boys up we need to get right in the center that's that's about as close as it's gonna get we need to to make these guys weak because none of our guns are gonna kill one hit yeah there we go now everyone should have a pretty good chance of moving in and cleaning this up hopefully so, see, so you can, like, take a shot on this guy. You got a great shot on that guy. Beautiful. Let's see, who's left? You've got a shot, so you can move up and also do a very similar move. Yep, you'll have one shot on a guy up here. Before we do that, is there anyone else who can move up to there? You can actually move up and maybe pistol a guy to death. Maybe. Solid copy. Let's see. Are you able to get down there? No, you aren't because people are standing in the way. That was my... That's unfortunate. This will kill if it hits. Okay, maybe it won't. Maybe it'll only do five damage. And everything will be awful. Um... Do you have any, any sight back here? No. Doesn't look like it. You still move up and maybe overwatch, though. So. Not you. You will also not have any sight, but you can also move up and overwatch. These guys should be fairly weak. Let's see, 72. We can probably kill. You can't even peek over anymore. That's annoying. Because we have to overwatch from up there. You're still not really in this fight at all. You're going to move actually to here with the hope that if they come up here, I can shoot them. 
So uh, let's let's flashbang them to guarantee they're not gonna do anything crazy. And since we can't really guarantee a kill here, I think flush has a better chance to hit. It does. It does way less damage. Like, does it say how much damage? No idea. But way less damage, but it should do at least one damage. <laughs> it does eight. I could have killed any one of them. Okay, alien activity. What are they gonna do? Are they gonna do? They're taking shots. That was close. Do you have cover anymore? No. But they have been thoroughly flashed and red fogged. That's all we need. All right, can you guys hop out this window? You can. Go ahead and hop down here. Lay into these floaters. Beautiful. Just need uh, probably a saw guy to finish them off. Or medic. Maybe one of the medics to come up and do it just so a little more experience. 77. 15 damage from this gun. There we go. There is still another pod somewhere, so we do have to worry about that. And I... They must be in the far corner. In that case, um... Let's go ahead and use one motion tracker. Just... Can I use it, please? Apparently not. Oh, your, your turn's over. No duh. I'm an idiot. I want to make sure they weren't right there. So I want that milled. So we're gonna move you to like here. Right, Shouldn't see anything extra from there. You're gonna overwatch. You're gonna overwatch from that corner. You need to move down and reload. There's an alien saucer apparently somewhere. You can reload, and that's the end of the turn. I'm assuming they're in that far corner, or they could be right there, maybe. Uh, did you not reload? It's killing time. Uh. Okay. Whatever. Just turn on the motion tracker. There's no one there. We'll move you up. Okay. No one there. Okay, they definitely have to be in that. Okay, they're like right there good to know so I'll have some people move up to support you you are gonna run over here you're gonna grab the meld and you're also gonna run up to support 16 meld you're gonna move one and then reload there we go you are probably gonna move up move up to here Shouldn't see anything extra from here. And then next turn you can move to here and provide some nice sight. You are going to move probably here, not too far up. Overwatch. And you, with no ammo, can you get on the, you can in fact get on the roof. You're gonna move to here and you're gonna reload and then maybe you'll run up to there next turn. There you go. Oh, they're coming up. Interesting. That's an 84% miss. That's not great. If, if they just come this way, I, it shouldn't be too bad. Okay, they're not, really. They're hiding behind the pumps. Which, if I had brought Rocket Man, which I kind of considered to bring Rocket Man. This would have been great. I did not bring Rocket Man, though. All right, you. You live here, and that should be a flank. Okay. Be a beautiful flank. Yeah, look at that. It's only 70%, but that's all you need. Sometimes that is all you need. I may smoke myself out this turn. See, I, I can just flashbang them too. Is this everything? This is gonna be 11 aliens. This was moderate, wasn't it? That might not be everything. If it is everything, then I can just, you know, run up with complete disregard. I'm gonna have to actually move up closer. I'm gonna have to take cover on the gas tank. No, I, I didn't take cover here. That's not as bad. This way I can flash all three of them. 
Make sure. Yep, yep, there was the cone. Make sure they're not going anywhere. Gotta love those flashbangs. Alright, you actually do have some good shots here. Let's take the guy in the corner. That way everyone's kind of... Everyone else is stuck. Eight. That, that, uh... When you're, in, when you're in cover, you actually get a little bit of bonus armor. So not really too surprised there. We're gonna have you... You you can't see things from here. We'll just have to wait a turn. And then we're gonna have you dash all the way up to this soda. The soda. Come on, fire. 35%, 35%, 50%. Why do you have such a great shot on this guy? No idea. Okay, well, yeah, you can take the 50%, not the suppression. 50% on that guy. Yeah, why not? Yet yeah, you could not punch through that door. Ooh, and it's a kill, too. It's pretty good. 25, 25. We're just going to overwatch from here. Probably going to take some more ones at us. Which, uh, you know, I'd, I'd rather not take more ones. They're eventually going to hit. But, I mean, what can you do? Yep, more ones. It was close. He at least hit in the right direction. Uh, same thing. Just repeat my comment from last time. All right. So, since everyone is ready, if we move up and trigger any enemies, we can always run back. Okay, no one? That's the car. I thought that was, like, something way worse. <laughs> this is the car. Um, you can run a gun and get a nice shotgun in on the uh, full health guy. Yeah. Then you can actually take another shot on the, uh, the guy in the corner. See if you can finish the job. You cannot. No rounds. Just being aimed. Worth a shot. That is a pistol now. That is unfortunate. Very, very unfortunate. I forgot that I had switched to the pistol. Shotgun guy. Don't worry, I will come bail you out. It'll take a little bit. But I'm I'm coming. I'm on the move. Switch to the right people. There we go. You've got a 100% chance on this little guy. Impressive. You managed to incorporate him into your torso before firing. And you also have a 100% chance to finish. Is that everyone? That is everyone. There we go. France, you have been saved. Your flat, flat cups and your soda bottles has been saved. That it, that's like the smallest 2 liter. Like, look at that. Look at that cup compared to that 2 liter. It's like the same size. That must be the world's biggest cup. That's the only thing I can think of, at least. All right, so, a little, a little farther in the day, the February fifth. Yeah, no one got hit. It's pretty good. Substance is crucial to our scientific pursuits. Did we get meld? We got twenty-four meld. We got the second cancer too. I'm not sure if there was three or not. Did get the second one though. We managed to get through all the floaters too without too much issue. The flashbangs really are helping me out here. And there's still not I too much I can do until Xenobiology is done. That's the wrong thing. Let me, let me spin the globe a little bit. Come on, Xenobiology. There we go. Why'd you learn, Valen? You're telling me that we should risk the lives of our troops so we can take one of these things alive. Yes. Without a live specimen, I'm afraid we've reached the pinnacle of what my team is able to accomplish. And how do you suggest we do this, Doctor? The autopsy I've just completed confirms that the alien's physiology is quite similar to our own. A highly concentrated electrical current delivered at close range should cause neuromuscular... Close range? And what happens if it doesn't work? Do you really think this is worth Why not risk? Trank darts, Alan? Surely Trank we darts do not know would work. Our enemy. How can we hope to stop something that we do not understand? If we can capture Get a couple alive, dozen elephant tranquilizers and shoot into a sectoid. That should be more than enough. Interrogate it. Find out what they want. Where they're operating from. Yes. That possibility outweighs all risks, in my opinion. Well, you can, can say that because you're not on the field. You don't actually have to do it yourself. I do not know how we could possibly communicate with it. Not to worry. I will see to that. All right. I'll speak to the commander. 
Valen's got a bucket and a wet cloth. <laughs> She's ready to begin the waterboarding. Sign new research. Okay. Let's see. I think attainment, that is, they're having a great time with those exclamation points. Target module. That's, uh, what, extra crit chance? Uh, yeah, bonus crit chance. There we go. Alien containment, we do need to build that at some point. This is, in fact, a priority. Should I do it? I wouldn't mind doing, you know, like, lasers? <laughs> lasers would be pretty nice. Everything's gonna take so long, because we don't have scientists, really. My only fear... I, I, I love just, you know, rushing the weapons. Weapons are great. If we... This will take, like, two months to get both done. If we do this last, we're not going to be fighting sectoids every mission. We're going to be fighting way tougher stuff. So, finding sectoids to actually capture could be an issue. I, I would love to do, like, autopsy for this or something. Oh, so many autopsies I want to do. I just can't. Meld, we... I want to do meld. We, we gotta do this. We gotta do the stun gun first, just so we could stay ahead of the curve in terms of capturing aliens. I expected that would be a priority research task, Commander. Ugh. I'll begin allocating resources to the project and immediately. I assume my facility is yeah, nowhere near being built. Troubles me. What do we risk with our own investigations into the melding of human and machine? What are you talking about? We, what? we see a line in the sand and refuse We to haven't it, made a mech forward. dude yet, we'll Shin. Get over it. Everything for the sake of yeah, Shin. We're gonna have to build some mechs. Um, South Africa. Yeah, we can do South Africa. And we get scientists too, so yeah. Take my take my sectoids. I have a couple hundred. AKA 30. That satellite is not done yet. Commander, there we go. Is and standing by for launch. We now we go ahead and launch one of these satellites. I still can't okay. believe Dr. Vaughan expects our troops to try to bring one of those We need to do South Africa. Countries. South Africa's Much less rough. Alive. We want the con the continent. So let's see. Plus two defense. Will we get that uh, t uh, ticked off? If launched, we will have two thirds coverage. We get an extra scientist per month, which I would love. Satellite launched. Um, uh, maybe. That's plus one engineer per month. Anything else? Engineers. That's yeah, it's, it's all just random staff. Okay. Scan for a little more activity. Everyone's returned to duty. There's a scout. All right. Gotta go aggressive because they just run. Go on, air game. You gotta come back here. You, we can't engage you if you leave. Engage that bogey. You've got seven seconds. You two are going to be in the med bay for. He's so close. Okay. Well, it's pretty, pretty down. Contact detected. Just need to get one hit. Intercept. Do your job and intercept. They never intercept. Oh, uh, if it's not one and done, it's just it's not happening. That is unfortunate. We actually need a spin still. Okay, Europe's coming up. We can't do much for Europe. I just decided to ignore all that. China. Yeah, I'm gonna keep taking these scientists. What's my research time at now? Uh, 17 days. I think I got a couple of days off of that. We got the satellite. It's online. Europe is being ignored. South America being ignored. Next satellite is already coming up. Look at that. Our satellite is prepped and standing by for launch. We could build... Well, no, because we, we need to save that money for other things. Let's go ahead and launch a satellite in Egypt. And that will get us... Uh, everything costs less. For a while. But it, it's the it's the continent bone... Like, just the fact that I have the entire continent on lockdown that I want. If, if I start putting satellites over here, then I don't have interceptors to defend them. So there's no reason to put interceptors in different continents right now. So it's operational in one day. Thermo generator is actually coming up pretty soon. Uh, more weapon fragments from India, an engineer. Uh, we'll think about that's in five days, really. What what is India looking like right now? It's looking pretty bad. It's looking like real bad. 
Why why is the UK complaining? India should be complaining. Um, do we want to go for India at all? Do we care about India? Maximum capacity. Additional uplink. Um Plus two aim would be pretty nice. No, I don't I don't think we care about Asia all that much. We'll probably try and get Europe if we can. Bonus HP. Reduction in rank requirements. Yeah, we probably want to go Europe. If we can. It's not looking great for Europe. Come on, thermo generator. I want to build some buildings. Uh, Mexico. It's a scientist, so yeah. Xenoneurology is in like a bay. Your attention. Council mission? Coming in now. What do we got? Uh, unusual reports of hijacked attempt and authorized. Okay, so this is the start of the DLC. One of them. Which, um, alright. Go ahead and launch us. Two scientists, two engineers. We are confident that you I think Exalt hits this. Discretion. I don't think we fight Exalt in this mission, but I think Exalt is the cause of this. So, we don't have any intel, but I know what map it is. We are going to have to go through... It's like um, a freezer, like a butcher shop with a freezer, I think. Then into bar, and then the convoy's on the other side of the bar. It, it's, it's two buildings in a row. And there is... You can go on the roof of both buildings. They're pretty tall buildings. And usually what happens is the entire bottom of the bar explodes because rockets fly everywhere. My gunner did get a level up. Congratulations for doing your job. You got five kills. Shredder rockets. Ooh. That's just shredder ammo. Shredder ammo or heat ammo. I need a shredder. We, we need something to kill armor at some point. Um. Want to take you? Yeah, I think we want to take you. Suppression's nice. Everyone gets levels ups. I don't know why. It's very odd. Everyone just keeps leveling up so fast. I mean, I'm not complaining. They need their level ups. See, Grenadier, you get uh, extra damage with grenades. Uh, we will bring Grenadier, by the way. Congratulations, you get the assault rifle, and you get tons and tons of grenades. Just all of the grenades. Then let's go ahead and we probably want a scout. Same scout, different scout. Probably want a scout. We aren't really gonna have, there's no sight lines on this map for snipers, not really. Not unless you're off to the side. So maybe just take a rocketeer instead. Just start clearing some holes in some buildings. I would like that motion tracker though. Um, let's see, we'll take a medic, a little more uh, level ups for medics. See, yeah, you get the suppression. Which means you get the assault rifle and a med kit and some smoke. We haven't used smoke yet, but we'll use it one day. One day, if I can find it. There it is. Four more guys. Are we are we still throwing rookies at these missions? I don't think we want to throw a rookie at a DLC mission. Those tend to be harder. Uh, we will take an infantryman. You don't need a med kit anymore. You probably need a laser sight help at all. It is plus four aim. So yeah, let's get a laser sight. You want you have assault carbine. Let's give you an assault rifle. Carbine gives you a little extra movement, but I want you to do that damage. All that sweet, sweet damage. You got 80 aim anyway. Um, I'll take two rocketeers. We, we have like a trillion rocketeers. Hey, random rookie, what do you want to be? Do, did I hear you want to be a rocketeer with uh, heat warheads? I, I, I think I heard that somewhere. Congratulations, you get to be a rocketeer with heat warheads. Rocket launcher. With rockets. Valen will not be happy, but who cares what Valen thinks? I mean, she decided to make, uh, like, the Viper King. Not not happy with Valen at all. Scout. Scout man, what can you do? You know what? Uh, good ground's probably pretty good, and there's some elevation on this map. 
Actually, you should take the marksman rifle because you can use it and move. And AP grenade and then flash. Let's give you the flash. Flash. There we go. And finally, we do have a gunner. We don't have anyone to flank. I don't know if I want to try and flank anything. We, we have a scout. Why don't we just take a rookie? Okay. Maybe we take a rookie with, uh, with a skill. <laughs> Let's get another intro treatment. Steadfast, covering fire, executioner? Ooh, that's probably pretty good. Alright. Look at the assault rifle with AP grenade and flashbangs. You gotta take those flashbangs. Lovely, lovely flashbangs. Okay. I think that's what we want. We got motion scanner. We have grenades. Lots of rockets. I mean, yeah, we should probably save some of the stuff for uh, that first panic mission. <laughs> but they'll probably be a bit ready in time. If not, I can always train more rocket guys pretty fast. I think that's what we want for all of our guys. I mean, infantrymen, yeah, I, I want you to have extra grenades just in case. All right. It's in France again because everything's in France. This is right next door to the gas station. France is sending an urgent mission. Yeah. Request. See here. Here's the the bar-ish thing, and then here's the meat factory with the roll-up door. You start on that end. You have to walk all the way down here, and there's a guy uh, next to uh, like a ruined Humvee, not Humvee, like an APC or something. And you gotta lead them all the way back, and it's they drop in reinforcements as it comes. 